Brian Antonio Brown has been cut by the New England Patriots, reported by multiple media outlets, Adam Schaffner as well. Adam Schaffner as well. I'll link the sources in the description of the source links. And um, let's talk about it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon button. Don't forget to check out our NFL playlist, NFL and NFL Live. Catch our live show every Wednesday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We uh, predict the, the uh, next weekend. We review the following week, so check it out. But, <clears throat> um, yeah. Today, I cut, I did a uh, video early in the morning, woke up, Sports Illustrated said that one of his accusers that wasn't suing or that wasn't uh, pressing charges on him, she came and did a patent at his house, and um, she said he made some advances towards her. Um, she didn't like it. She didn't finish the patent. Then he sent some text messages uh, in a group chat, uh, and he, he included her, and basically, she said he was intimidating her. He was calling her broke and... Oh, she's just doing this for money, but he lost his deal with Nike. Um, now he may never play in the NFL again. Even if this comes out to be not true, I think he still had a talent, but this is going to play out over a year. All right. He's not going to get the money that he was supposed to, he was supposed to get in Oakland at 30 million, but even New England, after he, uh, intimidated, a uh, somebody that wasn't a witness, the accuser wasn't going to the police or I don't know if she had plans to speak into the NFL as well, but you know, second and third incident. So three strikes you out. He had the one with Brittany Taylor that's ongoing. She's suing. And then he has the one with the, the, the artist that's not suing or, or pressing charges as far as I know. I don't even know if she talked to the NFL. And then he intimidated the latter, the one I just spoke of. And then he farted in the doctor's face. He's suing for not paying. He got a chef that's suing him for not paying. And then he had a personal trainer he didn't pay neither, I believe. So he has so much going on on top of the, the crying about the helmet. He just had so much going on. I, I think Bill Belichick was tired of asking, answering questions. He walked out of the he walked out of the media thing, man, today about the Antonio Brown. And he was becoming a distraction. Obviously, they didn't need him. Josh Gordon is playing real, really well. Philip Dorsett finally getting the offense. Wells, I'm not Wells Walker. Julian Elliman is doing well. And at the end of the day, the door is always open for Gronkowski to come back if the worst case scenario is they need another pass catcher from the tight end position. So they really didn't need Antonio Brown. They was dominant. His uh, tenure lasted uh, a game. And his antics, you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, all these people coming out the woodworks, you notice when you started with Bill Cosby, one accuser come out, then another, then another, then another, everybody get brave. When you don't do what they want you to do, when you make two of the historic NFL franchise owners look like a fool, the Roonies, and Al Davis, well, he's gone. His son, uh, Mark Davis, I think it is. And now, you know, now they had, they was looking to get Robert Kraft. You know what I'm saying? For all the things he was doing and stuff. So, you know, there's too much heat. Robert Kraft going through what he went through. They had the flag gate. They had Heron Hernandez and his whole situation. You know, it was too much for New England. They had a good team without Antonio Brown. I don't think Antonio Brown play again this year. In my opinion, this is going to play out. And at the end of the day, I don't feel sorry for him. You know, I understand what they targeting the brother, but really he put the bulls out on his back by being ignorant. And he making a lot of us look ignorant about the stuff that he, that he did over the off season. So, you know, at the end of the day, I hope he stacked his money up as high as the ceiling. So, you know, cause when money stops flowing in, you ain't got multiple incomes, you know, them, them legal fees and lawyer fees and court fees to eat you up. But Hey, I link the sources in the description. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Reach out to the email. If you have a business question, acquire response, ship a video request. Keep sharing the videos. And Antonio Brown is no longer a New England Patriot, man. And uh, it lasted one game. So it is what it is. So I think New England better be good without him anyway. One time for the one time we go.